There's a rumor that Tom Brady, the greatest quarterback of all time, will leave the New England Patriots, the only team he's ever played for, to potentially come to play for the Chargers here in L.A. His contract expires in the spring, and his future with the Patriots is especially in question after he posted a long message on Instagram thanking fans. He wrote, I just wanted to say to all of our fans, thank you. After a few days of reflection, I am so grateful and humbled by the unconditional support you've shown me over the past two decades. And he goes on about the team being eliminated. And then, in both life and football, failure is inevitable. You don't always win. You can, however, learn from the failure, pick yourself up with great enthusiasm, and place yourself in that arena again. And that's right where you will find me, because I know I still have more to prove, which I know, what more does a guy with six Super Bowl rings and a supermodel wife have to? Does he, <laughs> is he hoping to unlock the mysteries of the universe? Because I think he's leaving. I think I think he's good. No one writes a letter that long unless they're going through a breakup. And obviously, the idea that the Brady era could be over and he could go to another team is upsetting to Patriots fans. And in fact, in Brookline, Massachusetts, one fan is staging a protest outside Tom Brady's house. Hey, right hey! Now. Ho, ho! The no. goat must stay, he cannot go! Hey, hey! Uh, ho, ho! Oh my goodness. The well, goat this, must stay, he this cannot is go! Our foul mouthed little friend from Seekonk, Tommy Brady Fitzpatrick. He's two years old. He loves Tom Brady. How are you doing? How are you holding up, Tommy? Uh, decidedly not great. Oh. You're about to see a wicked case of the terrible twos if touchdown Tommy leaves Boston, you Ned guzzler. Well, there's no reason to insult me, but if the here, let me ask you this. If the team wants to start over and Tom wants to keep playing, why should he stay in Boston? What? <laughs> what? Why should, why should he, he stay in Boston? <laughs> yeah. Ah. Why should you he? Better watch your tongue, or I'm gonna cut it out of your mouth and hang it from the rearview mirror of my friggin' IROC Z. Oh, hi, Mrs. <laughs> hi, Mrs. Fitzpatrick. How you doing? We are in no mood for your nonsense today, Kimball. This is a very dark day. Yeah, well, I can dark see. Dark indeed. <laughs> I can <laughs> see that your son seems very upset by yeah, this news. Yeah, of course he's upset. Tom Brady is the closest thing he's ever had to a father figure since WCVB stopped Aaron Spencer for hire. Oh, uh, <laughs> well, that's very sad. Tommy, did you make that sign yourself? This one, yeah, I did. Yeah, we did. On oh. the front. It says the goat stays put. I see that. Yeah. What does it say on the back? I uh, show him, mom. Show me your knockers. Oh. It's a leftover from the women's match. Oh, OK. Yeah, my little Tommy loves knockers. Oh, a lot of Thank babies do, yes. What are you drinking there, yes. darling? What's that? What are you drinking there? Oh, I'm staying hydrated with some cigarette water. <laughs> what? <laughs> Is that a thing, cigarette water? Yeah, dongalingus. Every bottle contains the same amount of nicotine as a whole soft pack of Newport 100s, oh. but with only half of the tar. Oh, all right. And now you wonder why Tom Brady would want to leave. What? What? You watch your tone, you knob gobbler. We got everything you could ever need right here in Boston. Right here in Boston. Sam Adams. Uh -huh. Sam Adams summer. Sam Adams Oktoberfest. All of the flavors. All the seasonals. Plus, we got fluffernutters. Uh-huh. Chowder. What? Those are great, but I'm not sure those are enough reasons to stay if what? you want to play football. Uh, I mean, have you ever even had chowder? Yes. It's hot milk and clam guts. Okay, but... <laughs> Nectar of the God damn delicacy, you pecka necka. I'm sorry, but I don't know. The food might not be enough to keep Tom Brady from coming to L.A. Oh, we have okay, food here, too. Now. Right. You just want him to come out to Hollywood so that he can go hot tubbing with you and O.J., right? <laughs> no. yeah, listen, no. if he leaves, people in Boston will be rioting in the streets. Mayhem! Everyone, it will be Bethlehem! Have people it. will lose their minds! <laughs> from Governor Charlie Baker, to Mayor Marty Walsh. Uh -huh. Marty Walsh. From Robert Parrish to Robert Kraft. Robert Kraft. From Dickie Barrett Dickie to Mayor Barrett. Barrett. <laughs> to Joey Kramer, who is the drummer for friggin' Aerosmith. All right, Tommy, you're oh, getting a little bit excited, but OK, well, good luck. And but know that if he, <laughs> know that if he, <laughs> if he does come west, he will be in good hands here in Los Angeles, OK? <laughs> What the You lay a finger on the goat, I will personally end you. You are a piece of You piece of me. I don't. Tommy Brady Fitzpatrick and his lovely mother, Darlene. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Hey.
I just want to say. I want to say. <laughs> you guys really gave 110 percent. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> all right. All right. Here we go. I am Jimmy Kimmel. Give back this holiday season by my new book, The Serious Goose. I wrote it and illustrated it. All the money I make goes to children's hospitals across the country. So um, you know what to do.